Well, hey everyone, I'm with Jason here and we're at a special site. He's got his own wash plant here behind me and he's gonna show us all about it. So let's go check it out. So Jason, tell me more about your plant here. This is actually not my design. This is a gold filled trauma plant and it's rated for 25 yards an hour. We run a little slower. It's got a shaker deck on top yeah. with punch plate. Uh huh. Uh, goes into the nugget trap, then into the trommel. Then so we there's have, our trommel right there. Then we have a half inch punch plate that goes out the sluice. Check out the, we missed. Check out this sluice, guys. Isn't that neat? Pretty good. Now, you pretty much made most of this stuff, didn't you? Yeah, the sluice boxes I did myself. Yeah, that's really cool. This is the nugget trap. This catches most of the gold. Oh, yeah. Look at that. And that is three pound pun uh, punch plate or uh, expanded metal. So that's big enough. You can get half inch nuggets in here, right? Oh, yeah. Wow. Yeah, definitely. So and Anything that doesn't get hold up there, it's gonna it's gonna stop. So everything comes up from above here, straight up, and then drops onto this plate down here, and then the rest of it feeds further down out to the trommel. Yes. Cool. Look at that. Now look at your hoses over here. How much water are you feeding into this thing? For the pressure uh, lines uh, for the sprayers, that's a four inch pump, and I think that does uh it's i believe 39 psi because of that i need more water in the trommel so i add this other line off a three inch pump just for extra water for mixing in the trommel so jason what do you got here to uh feed the plant with this is a bobcat e45 e45 yeah using a 24 inch bucket and it uh it's small but it does the job how many, how many yards per scoop or? Uh, uh, six level scoops is a yard. Six level scoops. Okay. Very cool. So guys, this is what he feeds the wash plant with. Yeah, we got a punch plate here. The circles are one inch, but these have been cut out to about three inches. L allows a little bit bigger material to go through. Yeah. Well, you see, and then you got spray bars all the way around it, right? Yeah. Spraying into the thing. I think nine on each side, then plus the ones in the middle. It yeah. cleans it pretty well. Uh, the sticky stuff kind of holds up, but right. most part, it gets it all off there. So this whole hopper vibrates. It's shaking, yes, right? Yes, it's a shaker deck. Yeah. So you see there's the motor systems down there. You can see the springs on both end, the coiled springs, to get this thing bouncing. Yep. <laughs> yeah, it'll do the job. Very cool. Very cool. And there's just another look at the trommel down here. In fact, we'll just step over here. Get a little closer view of that. And then you also have this uh, conveyor here. Yeah, it's not proven yet, but we just put that in this week. And uh, I think it's going to work great, though. Yeah, so therefore everything comes out of the trommel and then up the conveyor and out onto the tails. Yep. Just allows for more runtime. Yeah, yeah. So, and of course, you're basically the only guy here running things, aren't right. you? Right. Yeah. So, guys, this is just a one man operation. Can you imagine that? Can you imagine how much fun you'd have with this? Yeah. <laughs> what do you want me to say? So <laughs> <laughs> Stage fright. No. Yeah. Yeah, this is a new generator. So, so, uh, so, what do you power this thing? What do you power this operation with? This is a 25 kilowatt generator that he just got three weeks ago. Uh huh. Um, it's awesome. That's and it's on, running right now. I, I can hardly hear yeah, it running. That's on idle, uh, even full blasts. That's full blast right there. Wow. Yeah, there we go. All the, there's all the dials moving there. Pretty quiet, though. That's amazing. Yeah. Yeah, because you and I can have a conversation and right. still have that thing running. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty good. Well, I guess uh, we're about ready to start... Uh, Running some material, huh? Yeah, let's get it all started. Let's get it fired up. On. All right, sounds and, uh, good.
All right, so we got everything running here. We've got the water going. Now we don't have the trombone turning just yet. So at least here's the floor on the sluice. Check that out. Looking real good. Everything's rolling and shaking. Yeah, looking good. There he goes, grabbing the load here. Look at that, Pop. Slowly, gradually feeding it in there. Yep. Man, this is so much fun. This is absolutely great. I can really get into this.
hey, isn't this cool? Wouldn't you love to have an operation like this? Yeah. Get some gold. Woo! Okay, well, let's go see what we got. Some color anyway. Yeah, right. That was a uh, that was thirty minutes right there. Thirty minute run. Yeah. And about how many yards you kind of estimate? There? Oh, that was only thirty minutes. That's probably uh just judging by the tailings here. Well, usually thirty buckets every one bucket a minute. So thirty but oh, there's some gold in there. Uh, thirty buckets. What I say six. Uh, there's about five yards, six yards maybe. Wow. Well, let's step in here and have a look if we can. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, look at that. Let me just zoom in here a little bit so we can see those. Oh, yeah, look at that. Yeah, there's three pieces there. Four pieces. Oh, yeah, there's, oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. they're starting look to show up. Oh, yeah, look at that. Are. Oh, yeah, there's some nuggies in there. Yes, they're sirree. They're starting to show up. Look at that. Woo! <laughs> yeah, yeah it's nice. that's what it's all about. Yeah. And, you know, I'm not really seeing anything further up the uh, the grid here. So, I mean, it's telling me that you're capturing yeah. everything right up front. Look at that. Oh, that's outstanding. I, I like it. It's just real easy to run. Uh, I'm not working. I'm just having fun gold mining. So that's it works sweet. out really good. <laughs> that's and what uh, you want. I mean, you're enjoying what you're doing yeah. here. And, yeah, you got a nice plant set up, just the right size, the right volume, you know. You're not overextending your overhead, so you're you know just just about right, you know. Yeah, I usually run. Um, if I run three times, of course I'm running the loader, the excavator, excavating, and that's a whole day's run, and I burn 150 dollars in fuel, no that's fuel it. at at seven eight dollars a gallon. So yeah, wow. so it's pretty good. It's uh, yeah. I, I'm sure you're probably making more in the gold to cover that. Uh, oh yeah, that fuel yeah. cost. Yeah. <laughs> Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is really super awesome. Nice setup. It's just sweet. I'm jealous. <laughs> Hope you guys got to see it too. Really, you know, watch this thing rolling. And yeah, it's one guy running a wash plant. Isn't that amazing? So anyway, that's pretty much it for the day. So I want to wish every one of you a very best in your prospecting adventures. Get out here and find some gold. And we'll see you next time. And thank you for watching. <laughs> Perfect. Awesome.